Hello, my name is Colin Gibbs, and I'm very excited to have the opportunity to talk to you a little bit about a study we are offering at Tier Memorial Herman um, that utilizes teen online problem solving, um, a problem solving approach to coping with brain injury. So the purpose of uh, teen online problem solving is to help parents, families cope in response to injury and other stresses in their lives, uh, to provide the injured individual with an executive function and heuristic for addressing post-injury challenges, and to be flexible enough to accommodate the different kinds of issues facing survivors and their families. It's a multi-site study. The lead site is at uh, Cincinnati Children's Hospital um, in Ohio. Uh, this intervention was developed by Dr. Sherry Wade there at uh, Children's Cincinnati. But it's uh, multiple sites across the United States. So the um, problem solving, uh, online problem solving involves seven to 10 core sessions plus supplemental sessions as needed. Um, an initial uh, meeting with the therapist and subsequent meetings uh, conducted via video conferencing. Um, each session has uh, two components. There's sort of a self-guided web module that provides didactic information and then a synchronous session with the therapist. So just to tell you a little bit about um, what uh, this intervention entails. So there are uh, core sessions um, that are, include getting started um, and setting goals, staying positive, handling stress, solving problems, getting organized, staying in control or self-regulation, controlling your anger, uh, verbal and nonverbal communication, social behavior and problem solving, taking care of you, supplemental sessions, and then moving forward and planning for the future. So the su uh, supplemental sessions are listed here below and there are um, you know, some different, uh, different sessions that may be important to some families, but maybe not all families, but we have uh, supplemental sessions addressing sibling issues, taking care of yourself for parents, dealing with feelings of guilt and grief, marital communication, coping with pain, coping with seizures, uh, sleep-related issues, um, planning for after high school, and finally working with schools. So here we have some uh, screen captures of the uh, online problem solving. So this would be uh, after participants uh, become enrolled in the study, um, they will have access to this platform that provides a uh, very uh, user-friendly, uh, interactive intervention. So once again, we can kind of see some of the primary sessions here, getting started, staying positive, um, problem solving, um, and uh, different uh, types of uh, um, problem solving approaches. So one of the uh, problem solving approaches that we, that we utilize um, is a five-step problem solving process. So step one is aim, um, which basically means sort of what's the overarching goal? What are we trying to accomplish? What, uh, then we have brainstorm. So let's generate some multiple ideas about how to reach this goal. Um, then choosing the best, the best of those ideas then implementing or doing the plan. And then finally, at the end, evaluating um, that plan to see how it works and what you would do differently next time. So here's my contact information for persons who are interested in the study. Uh, it includes my phone number and uh, my email address. If uh, persons are interested, we'd be very excited to have you. Uh, we, just to further clarify, so we have, sort of two components of this study. One component is a self-guided online component. Um, persons can participate in the self-guided online component um, free. So there's no cost. Um, all you would need to do is contact me and I would send you a link um, to get started on that study. 
um, that, I mean, th that intervention as part of the study. So what would be involved there is, you know, just going through those sessions on your own as a family, um, but without any sort of uh, regular contact with a, with a therapist. The second um, component of the study, and, and this is totally up to family choice, would be um, meeting with a, a therapist virtually. Um, so there would be, you would go through the online portions of the, uh, of the intervention as usual, but having um, also having meetings with a therapist to discuss any issues or information in those sessions. Um, and that would be done um, synchronously uh, over a virtual platform. Um, if, if you choose the therapist uh, guided online intervention, uh, that would be uh, billed through your insurance um, at, through, at Tier Memorial Herman um, for the therapist involvement. But once again, if you choose to do the online problem solving, um, self-guided, then there there is uh, there's no charge and it is uh, uh, free to participate. So please contact me with any, any questions. We think it's a really good, helpful intervention for children and families uh, who have been impacted by brain injury. Um, it is a, you know, it's been demonstrated to be useful uh, in persons who have traumatic brain injury and their families from research studies that have been conducted, conducted over the years. Um, and the purpose of this study is just to get further information to determine um, what is helpful about the intervention and to help uh, improve the intervention. So that is, uh, you know, what we benefit, uh, what the benefit is from participating in the study for, from us as researchers. So once again, thank you very much for this time and please do contact me if you're interested or have any further questions.